One bright morning, Sophia received a special invitation from her dear friend, Princess Elena of Avalor. The invitation was adorned with glittering stars and shimmering colors, inviting Sophia to a grand royal tea party at Elena's majestic castle. Sophia's eyes sparkled with excitement as she read the words written in elegant script. Dear Sophia, you are cordially invited to a royal tea party at Elena's castle. Join us for a day of laughter, magic, and friendship. With love, Elena. Sophia couldn't contain her joy. She twirled in her room, her magical amulet glowing with delight. She rushed to her loyal animal friends, Clover the rabbit, Robin the bird, and whatnot the squirrel, to share the fantastic news. They chattered and hopped around Sophia, expressing their excitement for the upcoming adventure. The day of the royal tea party arrived, and Sophia, wearing a beautiful lavender gown, set off for Avalor. She hopped on her trusty flying horse, Minimus, and together they soared through the sky. Sophia marveled at the scenic beauty below as they approached Elena's castle, perched high on a hill. Elena welcomed Sophia with a warm embrace at the castle gates. The two princesses giggled, their laughter echoing through the castle walls. Inside, the castle was adorned with vibrant decorations, magical banners and floating lights that filled the air with a festive atmosphere. The royal tea party was set in the castle's grand hall, where a long table covered in a golden cloth was adorned with delicate teacups, saucers, and plates. The aroma of freshly baked pastries and the enchanting scent of tea filled the air. Sophia and Elena, with smiles as bright as the sun, sat at the head of the table. The room buzzed with excitement as their friends, including Princess Amber, Prince James, and even the whimsical wizard Cedric, took their seats. The first sip of tea was a magical moment as the princesses exchanged stories of their recent adventures. Sophia shared tales of her encounters with talking animals and her experiences in the secret animal kingdom. Elena recounted her brave escapades to protect Avalor from magical threats. As the afternoon unfolded, the royal tea party became a symphony of joy and laughter. Princess Amber and Sophia twirled in their gowns, showcasing their graceful dance moves. Prince James and the other royal guests joined in, creating a lively dance floor in the midst of the castle. Elena's magical musicians played enchanting tunes that filled the air with melody. Cedric, not to be outdone, performed a comical magic trick that left everyone in stitches. Sophia's animal friends, perched on the windowsills, chirped and chattered in delight, adding their own magical touch to the festivities. The highlight of the tea party was the moment when the enchanted teapot poured tea on its own, creating a dazzling display of swirling colors. The princesses and their friends gasped in amazement, clapping their hands with glee. The magic in the air was palpable, and the bonds of friendship grew stronger with each passing moment. As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm glow over the castle, Sophia and Elena exchanged heartfelt goodbyes. The royal tea party had been a magical celebration of friendship, laughter, and joy. Sophia, with a twinkle in her eye, mounted Minimus for the journey back to Enchantia. The night sky sparkled with stars, and the magical amulet around Sophia's neck glowed softly. As she soared through the sky, Sophia carried the memories of the royal tea party in her heart, a day filled with enchantment, shared with friends who made her world truly magical.